Greetings and welcome back. We're playing Distant World Shadows. Okay, hit the space bar and continue on. And we still got ships coming off the assembly line and I see our cash flow is starting to take the dump now. And let's just pop into our colonies here for a sec. Oh, we got one not happy. And what is your big problem? Probably reputation, probably. No, it's only three. Tax rate is too high. I guess you're just not overly happy to begin with. Do you have a spaceport here? And you don't. Well, let's throw a small one here. And that'll uh, give us the, uh, the medical and recreation facilities, and that'll bring our happiness up here. So I'm not going to do any tax adjustments to fix that. We'll just try it that way. Um, I should almost look at key points here. As far as planetary defense stuff. So he's sort of down there. I'm not going to worry. I'm not going to worry about this sort of area right here. Um, I'm just going to worry about these areas, I think. So just make sure that uh, we've got all that stuff. Okay. Um, maybe I'll do that. Do that one. We're right beside the other Lemurish race, and I see we have some Yothus right in here. So I think we're warranted on putting this stuff here. Giant Ion Cannon, Planetary Shield, oops, and Bunker. Got three troops, I might actually throw, eh, I'll just leave that. Okay, and I think we'll do the same thing here. Okay, don't think worry about that one. Not gonna worry about that one. That one's fine. So that one, what about this one? Okay, you got all that stuff, that's fine. And you don't have this stuff. They kept coming in at this world here, but that one's pretty close, so I think I, I, I might have destroyed these earlier trying to save money, but oh well, I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Because they do want this stuff here. Okay, I'm not gonna worry about that one. I guess I better do that one since the office are right beside us here. Okay. And we'll definitely do that one. Because this area over here is sort of off on their own, unfortunately. So make sure that we have... Uh, Lots of protection. Okay, so uh, this stuff should have it already. No, where are you? You're over here as well. Um, not a whole lot of people in here yet. Growing at zero percent. Hey, why is that? I'll drop the taxes here a bit, like five percent or something. See if that makes a difference. Um, facilities. Do I want that? Um, I can almost get rid of these, eh? Yeah, let's get rid of the science academies. Um, actually, I'm gonna scrap all these. I'm not even using spies. I haven't been in my <laughs> in my uh, espionage forever. I think I got. Yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of it. So that'll save a bit of money there. Or we could replace it with this stuff. But like I said, uh, it's not a very big place. I might just leave that one for now. So we got the bunkers and everything here. Planetary shields. Oh, 
Put the ion cannon there. Shield and ion cannon here. Okay, and this one. I guess you better do that there too. Okay, so with this stuff, it gives us a bit of breathing room if somebody does attack that colony. Um, the planetary shield slows them down from actually getting to the planet, so then we can maybe bring some forces in to take care of it. Okay, so um, how are the Wekkers towards us at this point? Mm -hmm. Still furious. The reputation is really hurting us, hurting us with them. Um, we do have a free trade agreement. I might throw some money at them just to sort of soften them up a bit. Okay, so plus one, so hopefully that'll get better over time. Yeah, it's probably going to be an episode or two of just uh, sort of regrouping and getting things ready. And hopefully these guys come around real quick. I basically can't do nothing while my, my uh, reputation is so bad. I want to get that fixed. So maybe in the meantime we can look for a side project. What can we do while we're waiting for all that to get going? One thing I have been neglecting is defensive bases. I haven't really been building a whole lot of those. How many do I have? Yay, yeah, you get to come in this screen again. Um, defense bases. None! Absolutely none! I think they're fairly expensive, though. Uh, 73 to maintain. But yeah, you get a couple around a couple few planets that adds up pretty quick. You seem to be doing alright without them. So I guess I'll just let that go for now. Yes, I don't know what little side projects we can come up with here. Let's see any more pirate bases. I think the pirates are pretty much a non-issue at this point. Okay, here comes that stuff now. Watch your money go down the toilet. Wow, some of these constructors have no mission. Let's have a look at our supplies here. And we'll sort by type. Ooh, we got some inflation. That's probably why my stuff's been, my cash flow's been fluctuating so wildly. It's this inflation. Look at it. 2.5 on gold. 2.5 on, oh man. So that's making things more expensive. Yeah, what are we doing for luxuries? Just missing the super luxuries by the looks of it. Oh, and in Sandy and Opal, but that's pretty rare. So we're doing alright with luxuries. Don't have any super luxuries yet, though. I should almost go see where they are. Uh, known resources. And Caribbean Spice. One source of it right there. And the Yothless have it. Okay. So when we do our next war, we definitely want to come up sort of that way. Okay, so that's Corabian Spice. Let's have a look at Zintabia Fluid. Wow, I'm not seeing any of that.
Oh, Zentabia fluid, the Keterovs own that. Okay. So one source of each mega luxury. Uh, what's the other one? Lore's fruit. Lore's fruit. I'm not seeing that one. Holy crap, I'm not seeing that one. I wonder what the galactic stockpile of that is. And Laura's fruit. There is none on this map. There is zero Laura's fruit on this map. That's the first time I've seen that. That's interesting. That is very interesting. Okay, well, I guess we're not going to look for any Laura's fruit then. Okay, so what else can we look at? Um, we got our fleet sort of up to snuff. Um, I don't know what else to do right now. We're kind of waiting for everything to sort of calm down. Still notorious. That's getting better. Okay, there's our ambassador. Okay, so ignorant ways will probably disappear shortly. Uh, coveting never disappears. Uh, huge strength and power might disappear if they get big enough. And yeah, notorious. Uh, we we really gotta try and get that sorted out. I'm not sure what else to do about it though, other than give it time. This is where the pirates would come in handy if there's more of them around. So that's kind of interesting. Uh, I just thought of something too. I'm probably wasting money on research bases. Oh, don't have many of them. All right, I'm not going to worry about it then. I was, going to think, I was going to say if I had like 20 or 30 uh, research bases, I'd uh, get rid of some of them, but if there's only four, I'm not going to worry about it. Okay, so that's not an issue. Um, hmm, I just don't know what else to do while we're waiting here. Could do some tax adjustments or something, maybe. But that's kind of boring. Maybe I'll do that sort of towards the end of the episode. Who doesn't want to watch that can just skip it. Yes, well, now that we have them under subjugation, I guess we can sort of look at and see what their military is up to. Who are they fighting against here? Oh, the humans. Oh, maybe they're not fighting. They might be just going to refuel or something. Let's maybe pop in here. I get the feeling they are fighting, though. No. Or we're fighting, maybe. Ah. No, they're just going to refuel. Okay. Um... Yeah, they seem to like their six packs. Lots of their fleets are sixes. Probably just strike forces and defensive fleets, probably. And what they have in there? An eight, 19 ships in there. I hope they're not uh, attacking these guys. Nope. Uh, it's probably a private sector ship, I would think. Yep. Of course. Uh, 
Okay, I, I don't know what else to do at the moment. Yeah, it's probably another private ship. <clears throat> And our money's taking another dump. So yeah, I think I'll do some tax adjustments at the end of this episode, and we'll try and get that up to snuff. This stuff isn't helping, but... I don't have any other science academies around, do I? Did I build any of those? I don't think I did. Um, military academy... Yeah, I don't think I built, I don't remember building any of those. I think I realized when I came into the game that we didn't need much science, so. Okay, I won't waste any time on that. Who's that? race okay are they at war with war or the the mortalin not really but they're not very happy with each other Ooh, they're pretty friendly with the Keterovs. okay um, yeah, I don't know whether I should maybe pause the recording and let this run a bit. There's not much to do until I get my reputation under control. Oh, now I'm only nasty. <laughs> so that's getting better. Okay, let's see how that's affecting us now. Uh, poor reputation, minus 25, so we are getting better. Um, well, maybe it's time for another gifty. But maybe before I do that... these trade sanctions and we'll do this again. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take their money. I'm going to do this. So we took 600,000 off them. Now I'm going to give them a gift of 600,000. And all of that gave us plus seven past dealings. So I didn't really lose any money in that whole whole deal, but I did increase our uh, reputation with them. So that's a neat little trick to do. So reputation's coming back. That's good to see. Um, I think goes nasty, then diabolical or something like that. So we still got a couple steps to go up yet before we start getting uh, aggressive again. Okay, all these guys are in place. I was putting a star here, I think, just to denote that they were sort of uh, in position. So I might continue with that. I'm double clicking on the name here if you're wondering how I'm getting into the screen. Okay, you're in position.
Ooh, I just realized I'm in a spot where the shields aren't working. Uh, just hang on here. Yeah, I parked him in a bad system, I think. Where are you? Ah, oh, you're in here. Okay. Um, must have just refueled here or something. Well, I don't want you sitting in a gas cloud. I want you to be in a... Yeah, go there. Okay. That just gives me a bit more eyes up in here. And it's a mining station by a pirate frigate. Okay, we had an escort there anyway. Oh, might not be enough though. Oh, oh, nice. What on earth is on this thing? Holy moly, that's a powerful station. Titan beams. Two of them. I'd cut through that ship like nothing. I think it was just a weak ship. <laughs> Why do I have a mining station? I guess we found that one. Okay, well, I think I'm just going to come in and do my tax adjustments. Um, yeah, cash sucks pretty bad here. Okay, so um, what do we at here? 60. Well, I don't want to do much more of that, I don't think. I could. And once again, if you hear some noise, it's a snow plow outside my window clear in the parking lot. Uh, okay, we'll go with that. That's going to be some pretty good revenue. And let me put you up five. Five. I just like increments of five. I'm used to working with them, so. Um, okay, we'll put you up by five. Yeah, do all these bigger places, maybe. Oop, that one can't go up anymore. It's, that was that place I just built that space station at. So, we are now getting... Oh, maybe that's not the place. Okay, it must be another place I'm thinking of. Okay, never mind. Um, 18. 18. So there's not much tax adjustment to be done at some of these places. That one's not bad. Okay, we've got 5% there. And maybe 5% there. And you are maxed out. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, 22 will leave. That one will leave. Seventy-six k. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about those. Yeah, these are all pretty small revenue. Okay, don't worry about the rest of them. Let's just see what that did to us. Doubt it'll take us out of the hole, but probably make things a bit better. There. So it dropped us about 120 grand in the cash flow. Okay, I guess that's as good as that gets. Um, what else is costing us a lot of money? Troop maintenance? Eh, not so much. So, yeah, it's just ships and bases. So I don't think we can really uh, do much about that. As long as I keep some money in uh, in my bank, then I should be good. Yeah, we're still building ships too. Hey, do we have any uh, potential colonies? Nope. No pirate missions. Don't need 
need to worry about research stations. I could maybe start working on some of these. That might help. You know what? I think I might do that. How many construction ships have I got? They're all just sitting doing nothing. So, resort bases. I really don't even care where they are. I'm just going to do this. And hit resort. There, I'll just do this. I mean, they're not doing anything anyways, and it will be cash income once they're built. And that's it. That's all of them anyways. Okay. Let's put all our constructors back to work. Yep. Okay, so hopefully that'll help out. Okay, we'll, we'll continue on. How is our bonus income doing anyways? Resorts, foreign trade. Yeah, it'd be nice to get our foreign trade back up to previous levels. I think we we're like 300k at one point. Yeah, not a whole lot to do here. I wonder if maybe I should just let the game run between episodes a bit. Okay, Terrapin has ended. So the humans are... Actually, I should make peace with... Or not peace, but... Uh, oh. Hmm. Well, I guess I didn't re-establish the trade sanctions, did I? Okay, well, that's uh, up for grabs next time, then. Territory map swap offered. I don't think so. I think we pretty much know everything at this point. Oh, another pirate base. Oh, pause. How did that pop up? Who is that? It's the Cloud of Ravagers. Six ships. Okay. I think I'll come up and clobber that again. Uh, might as well take that fleet. It's still not built, really? Okay. Oh, refuel first. Actually, where's our second assault? It's over here. And we will refuel you. Carry the game on for a sec. And I think you got the range to get up here. You should. Yep. So we'll get the second assault to come up and do that. Actually, not gonna worry about the refuel. I think they're all pretty good, anyways. Get this local defense line out of here, and I'll be able to see the bottom row. There we go. Yep, everybody's got fuel. Okay, so we'll let that go. Okay, so yeah, we'll come up and clobber that. That'll help our reputation a bit more. What I need is another legendary pirate faction to show up. That's usually really good for reputation. Really good for getting some of your ships killed too, but... How is the leader looking these days? Not bad. Population growth is up. Alright, I'll take them. Not that I have much choice in them, but... See how the vector lines look these days? That's not so bad.
So I guess next episode is when we'll do this pirate base. Because we are at 30 minutes, and I know this was kind of a boring episode, but uh, this is kind of required to do. Uh, just uh, sit back and let things settle down a bit before carrying on. So I'll bring this one to a close, and if you're still with me, thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.